Hi friends, welcome to my channel. My name is Juan, I'm a yarn addict, hence the name Juan the Yarn Addict, and I want to thank each and every one of you guys for stopping by to check out my video today. This is a yarn and crochet channel where we talk about all things yarn and all things crochet, so if that interests you, please sit back and watch this video because today, my friends, I offer you a yarn haul from Hirschner's. So before I talk about Hirschner's and the yarn and things, I want to talk about what I'm wearing. So. I received this t-shirt in the mail a few days ago. I have no idea who sent this to me. There was no note, no nothing. It was just a package. I opened it up. Inside it was this t-shirt. So let me just show you this t-shirt. So it says, today's forecast, 100% chance of coffee and crochet. It's like the best t-shirt ever. Coffee and crochet. Are you kidding me? It's all the things. It's exactly what I do. I drink coffee and I crochet. <laughs> It's perfect. I love this for me. So anyway, coffee and crochet. Thank you to whoever sent this to me. Again, please sound off below or send me an email, hookedcreations123 at gmail.com, please. Okay? Thank you for that. So I do have this Hirschner's haul, and I do have a few things that I picked up from Amazon that I just want to share with you guys, just because I think they're awesome. <laughs> So, okay, um, let me go ahead and open this box. Wait, did I show you guys the box? No, I didn't even show you the box. Look, Ugh. it's heavy. It's a big one. It's a big box here. It's got all the things in it. All right, let me just finagle this so I can get it open and all that. Okay, so, all right, if my memory serves me correctly, I bought some things in the bag deals. So in that little tab in the website, you click that, you can actually get a deal and a steal if you buy in bulk. So that's what I did for a few of these things. Um, and I'll share that with you first. Well, as we go through the box, I'll just share it with you, okay? So first we have Premier Basics DK. I know, you're thinking, what, Juan Pink? Are you kidding me? That's so cool. And yes, it is. And I'll explain to you in just one second why I got this. But for the bag of three, $7.97 at, um, at Hirschner's. So there's that. And then I also got a three pack of the purple. The colorway is called Grape for this one. And for this one here, it's called Ballet Pink. So these two, $7.97 a piece for three. Let me slide up. Okay, so the reason why I purchased this, and I think I said a few videos ago, um, if you've been following, you kind of know exactly where I'm going with this. But if not, listen up, it's all the things. So I bought this because I received a package from a viewer who sent me a challenge for some yarns that she sent me. So I was sent this yarn right here. Let me crack this open and show you this. So it's super soft. I mean, very rarely have I felt yarn this soft. I'm not as well versed on all those kinds of yarns, but soft to me, okay? Anyway, super, super fuzzy and all the things, right? Okay, so I was gifted all of this. Now, the wonderful lady who sent this to me said, the yarn hates me. Every time I work with it, it just, just does not work, you know? So I accepted the challenge, she sent me the yarn, and after I received it, I played around with it and I agreed with her. It is some tough yarn to work. I mean, frogging it is ridiculous, right? So I said, I'm going to run it together with a DK weight yarn. And I believe I mentioned that on the channel. So I figured a three pack would be more than enough right? It's 918 yards for the bag. And I believe I have about that much in this bag. So I'm going to run them together. I'm going to dub this whole project the pink project. So stay tuned to find out what I make with this. It's going to be all the things. So there's that. It's going in the cubby right now because as of the date of this video, I have eight current whips going around not including mouths or cows so apparently it's K 
chow season, it's mal season. Like on my channel, I postponed my crochet along by a month just so that I could participate in some of the other mouths and cows on the YouTube streets. Um, so I'm going to shelve that for right now until I have some free time and room on my plate. Okay. So there that is. Now for the purple. Now, if you guys remember, if you've been following me for quite some time now, you'll know that a while back I purchased vintage yarns from eBay. And in that package, I received a whole wad of eyelash yarn, aubergine eyelash yarn. It should be in one of the thumbnail pictures, I think. Um, but yes, so aubergine eyelash yarn. Didn't know what to do with it. It's like 10 times more fuzzy and all the things than the pink. Anyway, I knew right off the bat that I could not work with that yarn unless I ran it with something. So that's what this is. So this is grape. It's a few shades lighter than the aubergine, obviously, but it's gonna give it some, some depth, some context to whatever it is that I make with that. I'm thinking like a hat, uh, a hat and a scarf set maybe. So yeah. Stay tuned for this. I'm excited. I don't know what's going to become of this purple project, but we're dubbing it, we're dubbing it the purple project. So we have pink and purple. Okay. So there's that. And again, I know I said it already, but I'm going to say it again, $7 and 97 cents for the, the trio here. Okay. So next in the same category for like bag deals, I wound up getting Soho Vista. So this colorway here is called Jungle Safari, and I wound up getting five balls for $14.95. So here's the three, three balls, and then two more. So five balls for like 15 bucks, you can't beat that. I mean, it's a good deal. So it's super soft, it feels great against my skin. Um, it is 90 acrylic and 10 polyester. And let me do a one for me and a one for you so you can see all the things. So um, again, Jungle Safari is the colorway name and it's very fitting because it's got this washed green look, which is great. Um, and it feels good. It just feels great. So it's three and a half ounces um, at 100 grams. It's 207 yards at 190 meters. It's machine washable and dryable, and they suggest a four and a half millimeter crochet hook, otherwise known as a US number seven. So there is that. And it's a medium four weight yarn. So it's definitely got some squish to it, which is nice. So 15 bucks, five bowls of this yarn. I mean, it's good. This is definitely wearable material, okay? So there's that. Next, we have the self-striping cotton cake mill ends. All right, I was fortunate, friends. I got twins in a bag. You know how I say twins in a stitch? Twins in a bag, I love that. Actually, it doesn't even matter to me. You can give me um, fraternal twins where they don't match or identical twins where they look exactly like, it doesn't matter. I don't even know if I said that right, but you get my, my gist. <laughs> it's been a long day, friends. Anyway, so this is the close-up situation. Look at how nice that is. So this here is self-striping cotton. It is 96% cotton, 4% metallic. We can kind of see the situation there. Look at all the shimmer and stuff. That's cool. It's... Uh, approximately 225 grams per cake and there's two cakes and there's approximately 875 yards per cake it is a two weight yarn it's a sport weight yarn and they suggest a c hook for this there is no metric measurement for this on the label so i can't really tell you but yeah super nice love that and I bought this at the regular price. I did not buy it on sale. It actually wasn't on sale. Um, sometimes these will go on sale for $11.99 for the pair, but 
$14.99 for two, which is still a good deal, all things considered. So there's that. Okay, next we have Roll With It Melange. My friends, a couple days ago, I opened up a mystery bag that had Roll With It Melange in it. This was called, well, it's still called the same thing it was called a few days ago. It was called, it's called Catwalk. <laughs> I can't talk. So, Amanda, Tat Mama, uh, and the Beg Brigade, I bought mystery bags off of her. I'll link her in the show notes. Um, so I bought mystery bags from her, and in the bags were these. And I've never tried this. This is new to me. I spoke about that in that video. I'm holding up two big green bags. Check it out if you'd like. Um, so anyway, I went ahead and ordered another colorway. <laughs> Purple. So the actual name is called Autograph. So I love this so much, friends, that I got five of them. I mean... This is definite wearable material for me. I mean, I love this. It's so nice. It feels great. And the best thing about this Roll With It Melange is it's machine washable and dryable. It's not like the macchiato cakes where it says to hand wash and lay flat to dry. Nope. You can actually throw this in the washer and the dryer. Just follow the wash instructions, which says to wash warm and tumble dry on low. It's great. Definite wearable material. Love the colorway. Love the color story and the sequence of colors in this cake. It's so good. So it is a medium four weight yarn. Um, they suggest a five and a half millimeter crochet hook, which is perfect. It's right up my alley. And you know what, friends? If you want some drape, use a six, a US letter J. It's going to work up beautifully. Let me get the cardboard off of that. There we go. So there is that. Okay, and so in terms of like ounces and things, so it's 5.29 ounces, it's 150 grams, 389 yards, and 356 meters. Um, and again, it's good on the skin. It feels great. Love this. Okay, so I figured with the yardage that I have here, right, it's almost 400 yards a cake, right? We're, we're rounding here. So 400 times five. This is almost 2,000 yards of a medium four-weight yarn. The possibilities are endless with this. Could this potentially be the Wancho Poncho? Who knows? Stay tuned to find out. So there's that. Okay, next on the agenda are Karen Cakes. So this was another one of the bag deals. So for a sleeve, it was $14.95, and that's a deal in a steel, friends. You can go to Michael's right this second. Well, my local Michael's sells one of these for $12.99. I'm getting three for just a few dollars more. Yeah, I was on this. So anyway, the colorway here is white truffle. And what I like about this is it's the taupes, the creams, the grays. I mean... It's a medium four weight yarn, and I did crack the bag earlier, and I kind of like did this. Um, and the hook recommendation that they give for this is spot on. So they suggest a five millimeter crochet hook, otherwise known as a USH. Um, it's 7.1 ounces, it's 200 grams. Um, let's see, it's 383 yards of cake. 350 meters. It's 80 acrylic and 20 wool. Um, so it's nice and fluffy. It feels great. Yeah, it feels good. And washing instructions are hand wash, lay flat to dry. I mean, it's high maintenance, hand wash, lay flat to dry, but depending on how and what I do with this yarn, it might be worth it to do that. Who knows? So... It's a deal in a steel, friends. It doesn't matter to me. One cake, $12.99. Three cakes, $14.95. I mean, there wasn't really much to think about when we talk about this. So, there's that. Okay. 
six cakes. All right, so next I bought a whole slew of these DK cast offs. So with weather changing into the warmer climates for those of us in the Northern Hemisphere, I wanted to play around with lighter weights of yarns. So, I mean, I've been playing around with Lion Brand Mandala, which is a light three weight yarn, but I wanted to explore a little bit and, you know, just test the waters with different kinds of DK weight yarns. So with that being said, I saw the sale. It's f It was $5 for a bag of DK cast offs. That's a deal. I mean, when you look at the yardage and things, so for three and a half ounces, 100 grams, it's 306 yards a skein, right? So times that by three, that's 918 yards of yarn in a bag for five bucks. I mean, yeah, 300 grams total. This is a deal in its deal. So anyway, I bought a bag of every color they had. <laughs> every color they had. I went click, 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 all the way down. I mean, I'm not going to cherry pick. I'm just going to try them all. I don't know what I'm using these for as of yet, but who knows? Stay tuned. I can't wait because there's tons of projects out there that call for a lot of different colors of yarn. This might be that. Who knows? Anyway, so I got pur purple. I got lime, three bags, lime. I got light blue. And I'm keeping them in the plastic because if you've been watching my videos, I'm bagging up my excess yarn just to like keep it dust free. And you know, when I work in here, I'm noticing like I'm getting stuffy. And I think that's just because of the fibers that are floating in the air um and yes i have an air purifier but i have a lot of yarn so the purifier is working overtime <laughs> so anyway this one is called fern this one here is called raspberry this is nice next we have ballet pink which, what is this called? Ballet Pink. I mean, different strokes for different folks, friends. I don't know. Anyway, was that called Pink? I'm just making sure. Sorry. Correction. Petal Pink. Petal Pink, not Ballet Pink. It's been a long day. It's okay. We're getting through it. So orange, and then we have what's, what appears to be like a lavender. So nice. And this one here is called blue raspberry or blue teal. Teal blue. <laughs> so super nice, okay. So next, I got those uh, bundle bags again. So I wound up getting two of these. So this is like the spice package, right? So this colorway right here is called Spice. And I think they just named the whole entire bag after the variegated yarn. I bought two of them. I cracked the other one open to kind of save time. So we're just gonna jump right into it. The first one is called Burnt. It's just called Burnt. I had to look at it like three times just to make sure. It's Burnt. So it's giving me like a Burnt Orange, um, a Burnt Sienna. Well, Burnt Sienna is more red, I think, but Burnt, okay? Next, we have this uh, Soft Gold. It's not necessarily a pale yellow, just a Soft Gold. And I love this color. It's so nice. Next, we have this beautiful color. It's called Sea Spray. Love that. And Hirschner's yarns, I mean, they're good. 
it's it's so nice. I love Hershner's yarn. And obviously, Spice, the variegated yarn. Now, the awesome thing about this, and I'm sure many of you guys already know this, but for those who don't, it bears worth repeating, that um, these colors here, accent colors, work very well with the variegated yarn. So this is the star of the show. These are the backup dancers, the backup singers, you know, the understudies. <laughs> so, yeah. Either way, any way you slice this pie up, it's it's nice. You can eliminate one of these colors and it will still work beautifully together in harmony because of how this all works up. It's so nice. So, I've wanted this for quite some time, but every time I went to place a Hirschner's order, this was either on back order or not available. So when I saw it, I said, you know what? I need to snatch this up. It was just timing because I'm sure this was available when I wasn't looking. It just so happened that like when I was ready to place an order, it wasn't available to me, you know? So anyway, I got two of them and funny story, in the stash in the next room, I have all of these colors I bought separately, um, with exception to the burnt. I don't have this. I have these. So I bought two packs to work in a project independently from what I have in my stash. But if I should need more of these, I have them. So there's that. Super happy and excited about that. So I'm super happy with this haul. I'm ecstatic that it got here in like three days. I mean, again, never has that ever happened. So the fact that it's here is awesome. I can dig in and play around with the yarns and, you know, bag up the stuff that's not bagged. <laughs> so there's that. Okay. Now I want to just literally jump right into the Amazon items that I purchased and got in. So I've shown these already on my members live. They've seen this already and all the things behind why I have these, but I just kind of want to show you guys. Uh, first, Sirens Atlas. So there's inspiration behind this, friends. So Ola Joe, the crocheting sailor, um, came to mind when I, I happened upon this. I was just surfing Amazon, looking at crochet books and things. I'm always looking for different things to, to look at and to learn and stuff. So I came across this and I said, let me look into this for a minute. So I did some research and this is so nice. Let me read this to you very quickly. It's very small and it'll sum up everything here. So Sirens Atlas is your guide to crocheting an ocean of grainy squares inspired by the colors of the high seas. Each of the 64 patterns in this book is a fun new take on the traditional granny square, named after a sea, ocean, or body of water around the world. Perfect for the intermediate to expert crocheter looking for a challenge and to improve their crochet skills and knowledge. Inside you'll find 64 crochet square patterns in both chart and written format and all the things. So, first of all, it says intermediate to expert crocheter. I don't believe that for a second. I think that anybody with a hook and some yarn and some patience can get any pattern. So, whether it's beginner, intermediate, advanced, to me, that's nothing. So, I don't let that bother me at all because truth be told, I mean, how do we differentiate between like who's experienced, what's an expert, what's a beginner? Just you take it for what it is and you move on and you, you do your best, you know? Anyway, what I like about this is there are patterns from, I mean, it's these patterns are named after bodies of water around the world. You know, and with Ola Joe being the crocheting sailor, I, th I thought to myself, this is perfect. Are you kidding me? This is great. This is inspiring. I looked at this and I said to myself, I mean, look at all the patterns and there's little circles all around the world here on the map and everything, you know, equates to whatever is in here. It's so cool. 
Anyway, I was inspired to buy this book. And so, yeah, I reached out to her and I said, you're getting happy mail. So anyway, I'm sending her a copy of this book. And I'm super excited to begin working on this in a few months from now. Not right now. I want to read this. I want to enjoy, you know, just looking at all the things. And then maybe when the weather gets warmer, I'll dig into this because I don't know about you, but in the summer months, I don't like to have all the things all over me. Just give me some squares to work and then I'll sew them together and I'll create things when the weather is warmer because I'm a year round crocheter, you know, so there's that. Anyway, Sirens Atlas. You can find this on Amazon. Okay. Next, this one. So this book here is Crochet Southwest Spirit by Susan Kennedy. I actually found this book by watching another channel, a friend of this channel, a friend of mine. Her name is Dee. So Dee's Creative Hands and Crochet. Um, and a few other content creators also had this. Um, and so I said, you know what? I need to check this book out. And I'm so glad that I did because there are some amazing patterns in here that is so inspiring. I mean, the Canyon Moon Blanket, look at this beauty right here. Are you kidding me right now? I mean, it's beautiful. And it gives you the recipe and it tells you how to make it and all the things. Um, it's got blankets, it's got ponchos, it's got wall hangings. I mean, look at this wall hanging. I can take this, this design and transform it into some sort of wearable, just put my own spin on it. And so the colorway sequence here is just phenomenal. It's right up my alley. I love all the things that this is showing me here. I love this. And so I'm inspired. I looked at this and I said, I need to do this. Oh, this is so great, this book. So I encourage you guys to just check it out. Again, Amazon. Crochet Southwest Spirit by Susan Kennedy. Okay? And so there's that. So my friends, that is all I have for this video. Nice, short, sweet, and all the things. Okay? So yeah, that's it. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, and of course hit that notification bell to stay updated with me and my channel. That is it for this video, my friends, and until the next one, take care. Bye-bye, friends.